Eunice. What have you done? I have only swept the compound. So, you now sweep the compound? Yes, so oh, nine. Many times called me a bad woman when I did not sweep. I have to sweep the compound for you people. Ah. Now you sweep the compound. Her broom has swept me away. What a wonderful day, what a wonderful day. Oh, darling, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, my super. <laughs> my super darling. Uh, hi. How many party was? Did you see what I'm going to do? We were drinking, I was just watching that you. It was fun, it was fun. When I have you next to me, <laughs> the sky is the limit. Oh, darling. I struck such a fantastic day in that party. Are you serious? 250 million naira. Wow. And I am not going to do anything. I am going to allow Solomon and John to run the business. You and I will just sit, travel, and enjoy ourselves. I have tricked them. Let them handle the business of your life. Give me all the children that I desire now. But darling, I can handle the business. I can run <laughs> your business. No, no, let them run the business. You just enjoy yourself. Darling, I'm capable of running the business. Let me run the business. Look, look, look. You are a woman. You can't run that type of business. Huh? <coughs> let them handle it themselves. You understand? They will make life difficult for you. And you are not capable. What have I said that is annoying you now? Minis! Does he know you're coming? What nonsense. What kind of welcome is this? Do we have to seek permission from you before we see our eldest brother? Yes. Permission from me. Eunice, now you listen. We heard he had a stroke. That's why we have returned. Why are you pleading with us, Solomon? Push out of the way. Let's go in. Is our elder brother's wife. In respecting her, we respect our brother. Let us return to our houses first. Hmm? Now tell her that we have returned. You want to see him when he wakes up? He is sleeping at the tower. Stop. brothers cannot fold our hands stay in the city and watch you die in this village for lack of care no. Solomon are you by any means suggesting that I do not take good care of my husband or that I'm not capable of taking good care of him now that he's sick no no nobody has said that if all we are trying to say is that yes somebody is saying that in fact we are saying that and that is the reason why we came home to tell you Eunice that we have heard about your friendship with native doctors. Easy, John. Easy, John. You must learn to break the oil bin with care. 
Solomon allow me to talk to her. Let me talk to her. You see, this our brother trained both of us. He was able, rich, a man of honor and authority. But now, see what remains of Simon. Look at him. A paralyzed half man whose word is no longer law in his own house. It is now you that rules the house. You are the one that makes the decision and your words must be obeyed by him. Eunice, I ask you, what have you done to my brother? Are you accusing me? Oh yes, I'm accusing you. And I will accuse you again, again and again until you tell me where you lost our brother. Because this is not Simon. This is a mere shadow for God's sake. Did you hear him? He called me a witch. Well, Eunice, you deserve whatever he calls you. He wouldn't even let us take our brother to the city for treatment. I... I want to go with my brothers. You will not go. And if you go, I too shall go to wherever I like. <laughs> to your lovers? That must be the reason why you made him a half-man like you just did. So that you can go to wherever you please. Harlot. Brother, you just called me a loose woman. <laughs> oh, come on, come on. These crocodile tears will not get you anywhere, woman. They won't get you anywhere. He said, Brother, I, I tried to suggest to you to marry another wife, but you wouldn't because of church. Church! He said, This woman here is nothing but a prostitute. She cannot even give you a child, and you still stay married. You listen to me, John. You can call me whatever you like. But let me tell you, Simon is my wedded husband. He is not going anywhere with two of you. He said, right here with me. I am capable of taking good care of him. Nonsense. You jobless fools. You must tread carefully. You must tread carefully. We, we can't leave our brother like this. No, but this woman is evil. Are you know that? We have to tackle this. Man. We will, but then take this. We can't leave him like this. Oga, stop me here. Driver, stop me here. I said, stop me here. Why stop me inside the bush? Look at this man. What's your business? Why stop? Will you stop me here? Oga, say, stop me here. Oh, <laughs> Omanai, <laughs> Chiki chiki kule mwe mele ba hon Iwe we Mbe wan pi na rwa la ni amara la Iwe we Omo na e Iwe we Omo na e Iwe we Chuki chuki kwe mwe bele ba hon Iwe we Mbe wan pi na rwa la ni amara la Iwe we Ah o wangala hiri arere Iwe we Wanyo ma buru windonezi Iwe we Wan your map or she legis, he will. Ah, Oh, 
chiki chiki kule we me le ba hon iwe we me won pe na ro ala ni amara iwe we iwe we iwe we You have seen with your eyes how my medicine works. <laughs> I have reduced your husband from his high and mighty position to become your servant. <laughs> Just as you wish. Thank you, the great one. <laughs> thank the spirits. Oh, thank the spirits that serve the... The only living God of Ibaka Hills and Valleys. All oh, spirits of Ibaka Hills and Valleys. My lips gives you praises. There's one more thing. Speak. My husband's brothers, Solomon and John, have wings like the kites just because they have small money. Now they have threatened me. I saw them harassing you on how you treat their brother and accused you of being responsible for his condition. Shall we take away their lives? No. Let us break their backbones. Let us destroy the people they love, their wives and children. Then we will sit back and enjoy the sound of their weeping and gashing of teeth. Stretch out your four left finger. Henceforth, the spirits of Ibaka Hills and Valleys shall be as husbands to you. <laughs> they shall do great havoc for you. With this ring of fire, I wed you to the spirits. Rise and perform the normal ritual. That leave the rest to me. Dance out in joy, for your wish will be fulfilled.
Eunice? Eunice? Is that you? What? What are you looking? Dress up like this at this time of the night. Won't you go to bed? Is it your business I'm coming in by this time? I'm on the road to the office. In fact, I'm almost there. Where are you? I'm on the road too. I'm taking Prince to school. <laughs> okay, that's good. How is he? Oh, he's fine. You get singing. <laughs> singing? That's nice. Um, tell him I love him, okay? And I love you too. Oh, I love you too, darling. Bye! Oh, Prince, Daddy says he loves you. Love him too. Love him too.
approach. What is it? I'm at the office. What happened at the office? Fire! And nothing was born, and nothing was said. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Rose. You mean my office? J <laughs> and K Limited is burnt down? Yes, I got it. Completely. Come in, come in, come in, let's go there. Come in. Solomon, I've just been informed that my office is completely burnt down. What? Yes. Oh, Jesus wept. Calm down, calm down, calm down. I just got a call from Lesson. She says uh, my kids have been rushed to the hospital. Hospital? Yes. What for? Food poisoning or something like that. I don't have the details yet. Yes, I'll get it back to you as soon as I can. Oh, all right. Again. Someone just called me now to say that my wife and my, and my son are involved in a fatal accident. Jesus Christ! What is Oh, God. 
I brought you a biscuit. <laughs> when you ask for the money, Tony, don't, don't, don't do this. Don't do this, okay? Don't, don't do this. Tony, Tony, oh. Oh, God. My wife and my son are not here. They're not here, Rosalind. I'm finished. I'm finished, Rosalind. Can we help you? I'm Dr. Mrs. Morris. Good day, Doctor. Thank you. Thank God you're here, Doctor. You see, someone called me on the phone to say that my wife and my son were involved in an accident, you know, a head-on collision with a truck, and that they were brought here. But I can't find them here. Doctor, Excuse me. What's going on? I don't exactly know. Gentlemen. Yes. Can I talk to you in my office, please? Oh. No, she can't come with me. I need to talk to you. It's alright, Doctor. She can come. She's my confidential secretary. Please. Dr. Mrs. Morris of the orthopedic unit, St. Christopher's Hospital. You've said that before, Doctor. Is my wife here? Yes and no. You see, she is not quite disposed to talk to you now. Why? I mean, is she in coma or something? I mean, how about my son, Prince? Well, there was nothing we could do. They both didn't make it out of the accident alive. What? What? They are in the natural. Why? Why? The Lord giveth life. Wives, children, and prosperity. The Lord take it away according to his will. In our lamentation, let us be consoled by the reality of uh, the resurrection, when we shall see our loved ones again. Solomon, console your wife. God will give you more children as he did to Job. John, 
The devil has robbed you of your beloved wife and son. But our God is bountiful in blessings. In his time, he will give you a heart to love again and to family life again. Father Daniel, Father Daniel, why should God tempt both of us at the same time with the same kind of calamity? Why? Eh, why? In fact, I'm tempted to disbelieve the existence of that God. Shh! Don't talk like men do, men who have no hope. God is God and he will prove himself to you. Um, have you told home people? Well, yes. The elders in the village, at least they now know. Our only blood brother in the village suffers stroke. We fear it will kill him if we tell him. Yes. All the same, find a way to let him know before the burial. Hmm? We will. Yes, we will. I can hear you. I'm not deaf. What is it? Uh, come. Uh, get my brother Solomon or John on the phone for me. I, 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 I have this feeling I, I must talk to one of them. For what? I am not feeling fine about them. I, I want to find out to inquire about their well-being. It's not an important call. So I will not make it for you. Eunice, you are a Christian mother. Leader of the CWO of this parish. Is, is this the example you are going to show the newly wedded ones? Disobedience to their husbands? Biamokem, I will disobey you anytime. Today, tomorrow, day after tomorrow. In anything I know will not be useful to you. So you think that inquiring about the well-being of my brothers is not useful to me? Yes. Right now, all you need is your drugs. If you need them, call me. I'll get them for you. It's not as if it, uh, it's, it, it gives you joy to see that I sit here, half paralyzed every day, taking the medicine upon medicine. I don't blame you. Because I volunteer to get your tablets for you. I'm not a bad person, eh? Okay. Is that you? Yes. How is your family? How is your wife? And how is your work? Simon, what is it? What is it? Why are you screaming? Die now, or do you want to change the will of God? <laughs> mm. 
my beloved brothers and sisters in the Lord. To conclude my advice, there is need for togetherness and peace amongst all of you. To help you cope with this tragedy that has befallen this family, you all have to be strong. For the good Lord give it and he take it. Let a member of this family lead us in prayer. <clears throat> Madam Eunice, please do lead us in prayer. Father Damian, I cannot pray now. I'm still in a sorrowful mood. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. I will call upon the Lord, who is worthy to be praised. I will call upon the Lord, who is worthy to be praised. The Lord reigneth, oh, blessed be the rock, let the rock of my salvation be exalted. The Lord reigneth, oh, blessed be the rock, let the rock of my salvation be exalted. The Lord reigned, blessed be the rock, let the rock of mass. Adegu, every that woman, she is big, rich and thick. Ah. Is it because she now drives her husband's car, spend the man's money because he's suffering from stroke? Mm -hmm. That is not all. Though. They even say she has a hand in his sickness. Tell her. That she used medicine to give him stroke. Hmm. So that she'll be controlling him. Remote control. Mm -hmm. Jealousy. You oh. people are just jealous of a progressing woman. No. We jealous. Hmm. You mean you're not in this village? Have you not heard of the sudden tragedy that has befallen her husband's brothers? And then? They have lost virtually all members of their family. And have become poor overnight. In <laughs> fact, she's now the king, the barber in that family. Hmm. 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 Still yet in the church, they gave her the leader of the Christian women organization. Mm -hmm. Jealousy. Come, let's go. All I know is that I like her. Hey, you are still waiting for her. Oh, I see you. Hey. I'm fine. Eunice, Eunice, I've been expecting you. I'm glad you're here. Yeah. Is Susan here yet? She will soon come. Oh, okay. Ah, make yourself comfortable, dear. You're welcome. Thank you. Ah. Um, would you? You will go, eh? Okay, Auntie. There's no need for you to stay around. It's all right. Okay. Auntie, please, I don't have any transport for you. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, go and play, eh? Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> These are sales girls look smart. I hope she will not steal your money and be giving these young boys that will be chasing her. She will not dare. She knows me too well. Eh? If she tries it, I will tear out what makes her a woman and throw it to the dogs. <laughs> hey. Hey. Honorable CWO President, Madam Eunice International, take it. Mm. <laughs> and you, yes, Justina and Justina Abadawat Limited. <laughs> Baby, take it. Susie. Oh, um. Come there. Susie, Susie. Mm. You're welcome. It's Susie, not my fault. Please, uh, make yourself comfortable. Thank you. I can change. Yeah. It's not my fault. You're welcome, dear. No, dear. Anyway, down to business. I summoned this meeting here today to tell you that it's time for me to make a trip to visit the great Igodi of Ibaka Hills. Since you desire power to fulfill your wishes, I want you to tell me your desires so that I can tell him. Susan. I cook my best at my restaurant. Still, I don't have many customers.
common modern city sells more than I sell. I want to draw all her customers and many, many others. Before the year runs out, I want to own a brand new car. The start of that's all for now. <laughs> Susie, Susie. <laughs> and you, Justina. <laughs> I can't stay without young men. Hey, hey. Justy, Justy. Yes, sir. Hey, what? I know myself. I cannot see a young boy and remove my eyes. The worst is this um, young boy they brought to us as our parish priest. You mean Father Damien? Yes, sir. That boy gives me hay fever. Anytime I see him preaching on the altar, my leg goes like this. My legs begins to melt. <laughs> Justin, mm -hmm. do you want him? Eunice, only want him. I long for him. I desire him. As a matter of fact, I desire power. Power to seduce any man that tickles my fancy. <laughs> wait, wait. You mean your husband is not enough for you again? Forget that old man. Forget him. He is spent. Just chaff. <laughs> you are right. He's a chaff. <laughs> okay. I have heard you both. Yes. I will tell him your wishes and your desires. And when I come back, I will tell you what he requests from me. Hmm. Madam Eunice. Madam Eunice. Uh -huh. So what would you like to drink? Uh let me have one. Uh-huh. Susie's. Mm. Stop. Uh -huh. I will be right. We are working. Have you taken your drugs? Drugs? Do you want to die like Solomon's children? Eh? Do you want this throat to crush your heart as the lorry crush the heads of John's wife and son? Did you hear that? No, did you hear that? Simon, why? Why do you want to make me a widow? Eunice, have a mercy with your tongue. No, 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 no. Brother, let her talk. Let her talk because she can afford to. <sighs> Devils living with human beings and pretending that they are human beings. Have I, said, have I said anything wrong? If I did, I'm sorry, oh. Eh? Solomon, I, I didn't mean to remind you that your children are dead. Eh, forgive me, it was a slip of tongue. Be okay. Remember to take your drugs. Chuki chuki ko iwe bele ba hon. Iwe we. Mbe wampi na wala ne ya marala. Iwe we. Ah, wangala hiri harere. Iwe we. Wanyoma buru windonezi. Iwe we. Wanyoma poroshi legisi. Iwe we. Ah, wangala hiri harere. Iwe we. Tell your friend. The woman that owns her food house. Susan. Yes. Tell her that the spirits of Ibaka hills and valleys require her early morning urine and the blood of her first son. You go to the great one. I hope nothing will happen to her son. Ta! What would you do if anything happens to him? Doesn't she need the power? She needs it. Did you not 
tie your womb and made yourself childless to have your own power? I did. Uh -huh. Tell her what I have said. Now, your other friend, the woman who deserves the joy of the flesh of young men, Justina. <laughs> Tell her that the spirits of Ibaka Hills and Valleys require her to bring her daughter's inner wear and her hair. Bring these things to me and I, Igodi of Ibaka Hills, will make her young and comely in the eyes of all those who come her way. Do you record my words? Yes, the great one. Bring these items to me for sacrifice. After, I will give each of them the ring of fire. And power will be their own. Thank you, the great one. CWO Executive Committee, they won't know. They won't. I wish to notify you that soon the election for the post of the chairperson of CWO and other posts will be coming up. I wish to continue in my position as a chairperson, so I need your support. Thank you. Christian women, Otito Dilijesu. Madam Eunice, in what way? Do you need our support? Good question. A ripe corn is merely known by looking at it. I have been the chairperson for four years now. I have been a good leader. I have brought you respect. My class and stand is respected and feared in this parish. Who among you here can offer quality leadership? So you owe me lots of gratitude. And the thank you I require from you is to kick against an election. Just appoint me again as your chairperson, and you will all enjoy me. Bags of rice to your families, in Torreka to you, Abada to women, the CWO will be respected in this parish. Thank you. Otito Dilinu Jesu. I think Madam Eunice has spoken well. Let us appoint her to continue to lead us again. Supported. Umwanyi Bemundu Otu Christi. Let us reason a little before we conclude. Leadership of CWO is not all about power, money, or class. Like a good society, CWO leadership is all about good name and the fear of God. Say it loud. So, Monica, I haven't good name and the fear of God. I have not said that. But you have just said so. Okay, do you want us to make you the chairperson? Make it clear. Look, Madam Eunice, you have ruled for four years. Four good years. Give other people a chance to serve the organization. My dear sisters in the Lord, if Madam Eunice has ruled us well, why do we have to change her? Why? Let there be an election. Let the vote speak for the women. Yes. yes. Let us not quarrel over this matter. Let us go home and think about it. And then by the time we meet again, we will all decide. Monica, you dare to challenge me by the power given to me by the great God of Ibaka Hills and Valleys. I command you to be sick. You will be in bed until I decide what to do with you. He 
Yes, my daughter. Receive the power. Receive the power. Receive the power. Receive the power. Forget me forever. How long will you hide your face from me? How long shall I take counsel in my soul, having sorrow in my heart daily? How long will my enemy be exalted over me? Consider and hear me, O Lord my God. Enlighten my eyes, lest I sleep the sleep of death. Lest my enemy say, I have prevailed against him. Lest those who trouble me rejoice when I am moved. But I have trusted in your mercy. My heart shall rejoice in your salvation. I will sing to the Lord because he has dealt bountifully with me. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in beginning, is now and ever shall be, what we taught him. The peace of the Lord God be with you all. Amen. And also. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Hey, but how exactly did this thing happen? She was just sweeping the compound. All of a sudden, she shouted, and before I could rush to her, she fell down, clutching her throat and her stomach. Since then, she has never spoken one word. Neither does she recognize anybody that comes. Hey, could this be stroke? I don't think so. Because I didn't observe anything outwardly wrong with her. This is mysterious. Hey. <laughs> Father Damien, thank God you're here with your prayers. All will be well. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Nendo, you shall be well. My deserving daughter, my worthy daughter, <laughs> victory is yours. <laughs> Justina, yes. this is your ring. Susan, this is your ring. When you rub it, smoke will come out. But only you will see the smoke. It is the smoke of havoc. The fire of wishes. Do we put it on? Yes, on your forefinger. Good. Good. That's good. Then you begin to rub it.
What happened? Mama Nana has fallen down and he's not moving. He's not moving, Mama. Nana. 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 Mama. Please touch. Nana, please. I just brought it from Has it been? This man? No, it never been. So because of you, you know, sir, I like this on this, eh? I will give you a uh, 15 naira inside. Yeah. This, 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 this is for the lady. She's uh, going bye bye, yo. Uh -huh. Come again, no. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Your money, your money. Give an island, give an island. Yes, your money. And Thank you, my dear. Ah, you like this? I tell you, what if 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 I tell uh -huh. These rappers are wonderful. That, that is you're So, Madam Justina, what can I do for you? My office hours have not started. I know, Father. That's why I came. You see, Father, I've been thinking a lot about you. I decided I'd come and see you. <sighs> well... That's nice of you. At least we that are not in our hometowns, it gives us joy to know that somebody still have a spare thought for us. <clears throat> Father Damien? Yes. I want to sit near you. You're close enough. You can talk. I'll hear you. Speak up. <clears throat> Father. Yes. I want to sit on your laps. <laughs> uh -huh. Am I not um, pleasing to your eyes? Huh? Am I not beautiful to look at? Don't you desire to touch me? See, I know you want to touch me. Hmm? Go ahead, you can touch me. I won't be angry with you. Okay? Hmm? Touch me. Yes. <sighs> Hey, 
With the power of the Holy Spirit, I drive away all contrary spirits from this room. Depart, you children of Beelzebub. Let the root of the son of David germinate. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Most High God, for the Lord God is a sun and shield, and he reigns in glory. He gives us health and strength, and he provides us with our needs. Lord God, look with mercy upon your daughter Monica. Restore joy to her bones. Let her broken spirit rejoice in the Lord. Amen. I anoint you with the holy oil in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. We join our prayers with the prayers of the saints and pray in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Brother, I shall go now. Continue to take care of her. Clean her up. Force whatever little food you can into her mouth, at least to keep her alive while we wait for God to answer us. I will come again and pray for her. Thank you, Prayers of Father Damien. Mama is still getting worse. It's getting worse. Or doesn't he have the power of God in him? I'm wondering, my daughter. I'm even hearing certain bad rumors about him. Let's keep our fingers crossed and await the will of the Lord. Let's go. Don't worry, she'll be alright. And in the fullness of time when God decided to save his people, he instructed Moses to strike his rod on the Red Sea. Moses obeyed God and the sea divided. A road was made in the sea for the people of God to pass.
God spoke to Isaiah again. Uh, sorry, Moses. Yes, we are talking about Moses. God spoke again to Moses and instructed him to lift up a bronze serpent for the people of God, for the people of Israel, so that whoever looks upon it will be saved from snake bite. This instruction is Sorry, please, I have a little headache. As I was saying, this instruction was prophetic of the death of our Lord Jesus Christ. That is the end of the homily. I believe in God. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ. Havoc you have caused in this area is not enough for you. And I want to kill me with your vehicle. God will kill you first before you kill me. So you are not afraid to challenge me? Why won't I challenge you? Do you think I'm afraid of your mercy? Or do you think I'm your husband or husband brothers? That you have destroyed with charm? If you try your temple in this town, eh? See ya. <laughs> try it. Okay, let us see. Animal, you will suffer. Can no longer walk. He can no longer tap his palm trees. 
Our children are hungry. Madam, <laughs> it is the Lord's doing. All will be well. Ah, uh, Father, no. It's not the Lord's doing. It's not the Lord's doing. It is Eunice. A Christian mother for that matter. President of CWO. Huh? Father, you should suspend her unless she proves herself innocent. <laughs> Elder Moses. Yes, Father. Elder Moses. Father. Do you believe an ordinary woman has such powers that we cause somebody's legs to tear open? Do you? Yes. Yes, Father. It is evil medicine. It is evil medicine. That woman is bad. Can't you see how she destroyed her own family? Huh? And we have to do something about that woman, oh Father. Upon that, she is barren. That woman is completely evil. I am sorry. But I have no belief in charms. And I will not punish an innocent woman based on such pagan accusations. I will not. Madam, you go home and look after your husband. I shall come and pray for you. <laughs> Thank you, Father. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Peace of the Lord be with you. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Go in peace. Thank you, Father. <laughs> Lord, your will be done. She offers up to you her sufferings, together with all that her Savior has suffered for her. And I beg of you, through her suffering, to have mercy on her. Free her from this illness and pain, if you will, and if it be for her good. You love her too much to let her suffer, unless it is for her good. Therefore, O oh God, I trust her. I trust her to you. Do it her as you please, in sickness and in health. She wishes to love you always. Remember, O oh most loving Virgin Mary, that it is a thing unheard of that anyone ever had recourse to your protection, employed your help, or sought your intercession and was left forsaken. Filled therefore with confidence in your goodness, she fly to you. O Mother, Virgin of Virgins, to you she come, before you she stand, a sorrowful sinner. Despise not her poor words, O Mother of the Word of God, but graciously hear and grant her healing. Lord, Mama. Jesus Christ. Mama! Mama! Lord. Mama! 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 Before we go on, let us observe one minute of silence in honor of our member Monica, who has just passed away. Hmm. Now, about the dress we, CWO members, will put on at Monica's burial. I have just concluded arrangement with Madame Justina, who sells wrappers near the market. You all know her. She has agreed to supply us a special print of Abada, which she has just purchased in quantity. So each member will pay the sum of 8,000 Naira between now and next week. So that you can all get your wrapper before Monica's barrier. Have we all agreed? Yes. Good. We shall notify our other members in our general meeting later this evening. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm moving for adjournment. Supported. No, no, no. We, we cannot. We can't keep on fearing as if we fear this woman. We must tell the truth. 
Oui, il faut que nous nous parlions à John is right. He is just right. The worst is that she is even forcing them to buy it from her partner in crime, Justina. Oh, that even her money in doing friendship. Yes, she wants her friend to sell her market, even at her own expense. Let us send a delegation to the bishop so that he will send us another reverend father. Since this father Damian is so powerless, has even become friendly with Eunice and her friends. That is good. Let us call for a new and impartial priest. A priest that will handle the affairs of this parish with dispatch, yes. without sentiment. Yes. I think I buy your idea. Okay, I, I volunteer to go in this delegation to the bishop. Let us send four people. I, Edamosis, and the Dajon will go with Solomon. That's, okay. That's, that's all right. The earlier you do, the better. I want this woman to become a problem.
give him more problems, isn't it? So it's true. You're the one responsible for all the calamity that has befallen this family, Eunice. The death of her children. And the falling of her business is Eunice. Oh, so it's you. Yes, it's me. And what are you going to do about it? Eh? Eunice, God will not let you go unpunished. I leave you to him. <laughs> Shameless thing. Look at you. Just look who he's talking. Look at you. I'm just sparing you. You think I'll kill you? I will not. You will stay alive and suffer poverty and childlessness. I swear it. You will stay alive and see suffering with your two, with your two eyes. It's your oh God. God, do you hear it? You hear the bursting of the wicked and blood test upon your children, God. God, if I am powerless, you are not. And I know you won't be silent for long. Blessing, what is the problem? What is happening here? What is happening here, Blessing? Where is my brother, your husband? He went out. And you need came to rejoice over our problems. She did? She did. She even pressed that she's responsible for all the death and misfortunes in this family. Lord have mercy. She said all that? <laughs> It's okay. Um, it's all right, Blessing. Dry your tears, okay? It's all right. Don't cry. Wickedness will not endure forever. It rules, but only for a short while, okay? Now pick up your home. Go into the main house and stay there until my brother returns. The eyes of the Lord. 
rest on his people. For the Lord is the sun and shield, he reigns in glory. In his own time, he shall wipe away our tears. He shall take up his arms in battle. Our Lord will arise and victory shall be for us. Why do you weep? Why do you beat your chest in sorrow? Why do you seek help among the sons of men? Our help is in the name of God who made heaven and earth. Our help is in the God of peace. He has become our Jehovah Shalom. Yes, wickedness will not endure forever. Wickedness will not endure forever. Oh. Father Damien, we came to thank you and express how impressed we are with the godly and matured manner with which you have handled this untruthful rumors going around in the village about us. Uh, Father Damien, thank you for ignoring the rumors. They are not true. They are all born out of jealousy. They are not true at all. Um, Father, uh, please manage this little gift we have brought. Thank you. Um, it is too funny. How can they say that Christian mothers like you go about killing people with charms and consulting oracles? Of course, you know, I, I cannot take them serious. Um, thank you very much, Father Damien. We shall be leaving. Thank you very much for your visit. Thank May you, the Father. good Lord continue to bless you. Bless you too, Father. Bless you too. Thank you. Yes. Um, Madam Justin. Yes. Could you please stay behind? There is an important issue I have to discuss with you concerning the parish. All right. Um, Susan, Eunice, I'll see you two later. It's okay. okay. All right. Be coming. Baby America, baby London. Hmm. You see, she has gotten that father in Siki one. Hmm. Did you see how he kept looking at her? Yes, now. He was stripping her naked with his eyes. I have never seen so much lust. Hmm. <laughs> anyway, it is good for me. The more he lost, the more he becomes spiritually weak. The more he cannot deliver those I have tied with sickness. Yes, so. <laughs> well, let's go. The handwork of great Igodi of Iwaga here. Hey, I'm going to. I'm I and the bishop have already discussed this issue. And um, based on the investigation we made in your village, his lordship has decided to transfer Father Damien and send a spiritual father to your village. This will be done as soon as he returns from his journey. So tell your people to stop worrying themselves about this particular issue. Uh, thank you very much. We are very grateful. Please do not fail to do this. We are going through untold sufferings in our parish. Have no fear. You see. I have been the bishop's secretary for 10 years. Not once have I failed in my duties. And the most of all, don't fail to send us the spiritually strong priest you and bishop have discussed. All your requests shall be presented to the bishop as soon as he returns. I believe he will be urgent in response. 
Thank you very much. Thank you very Thank much. You. The grace for assistance. That's stupid, Madam She wanted to try me. Now I've shown her that she's of no way. Baby, this car is my lover. This car is my G. It's my everything. <laughs> No Congratulations, man. my sister. No you man. have done so well. Thank you. It is not easy. Thank you. <laughs> All things are well with Igodi of Ibaka Hills. Mm. Can you believe that this car cost me three million? You don't say? Ah. Come to my shop now. It's like Tejo Shop Market in Lagos. People come from as far as 30 kilometers away just to eat my food. Is it in Salasu? Egusi Obon. Onubu. Nkobi. Isiewu. Oba. Oboroko. There are chilled drinks. Oh, how can I ever stop thanking you for introducing me to the great Igodi of Ibaka Hills? Baby, give me the Oh! Uh, one person does not see the light. Yes, so I am happy I showed you the way. Oh, I thank you so much. I thank you. Would you? Auntie? How come you have not spread this clothes? I won't tell you. As as Every time you make me be talking in this shop. I'm sorry, Auntie. I'm not even going to be my showcase. I did that this morning. Oh, good afternoon. Welcome. Uh, you want to buy a bada, eh? Yes. Oh, we have so many. Would you take them around? Come and see. All right. You like this? No, these are more masks. No. What of this? These are Papa's wrap on. And this nice lace. No, I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, let's see. You need to. I don't like it. It's not colorful. No, no. And if these wrappers are not colorful, let's take the next place. Honey? Honey? Try uh, again. Go home. I'll join you. I'll meet you home. home? Can I go home? We have not bought what we came to buy. Go home and meet your home later. Okay. Move! Would you die? Come down. No, there are not too many customers, eh? Alright, so you will uh, take this. Mm -hmm. And go home. Okay, go and see your boyfriend. Mm -hmm. and I <laughs> Check this way for us, Wallet. Well, eh? yeah, 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 yeah. oh, my dear. You look nice. And you look beautiful. Am I beautiful? <laughs> I love you. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Treating me this marriage. Why me, honey? Actually, where's that money I gave you to keep? I want to use that money in buying abada. All the abada in that woman's shop are excellent. You don't even have eyes. See, see, see. Your eyes are meant for fancy. You don't have eyes. Where's the money? But we kept the money to rent a sewing shop for me. Nonsense. Where's that money? Where's that money? Honey. Let me not get you here. Honey, honey, please. Please, honey. Please. Leave my Please, honey. Leave my Please. <laughs> oh, God, please. Why me? Why me? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Why me? Why me? 
with him mm -hmm. yet. <laughs> See, my dear, what are you going to drink? You know, business is good today. Hey, fine. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't bother about drink for now. Yes. I bought cool. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Susan yes. has just bought a brand new Boraka for cool three million. Tell me, now we met. This is it. Celebration of love. All the rapper he bought from you, he is no longer himself. Eh? Now return his money back. Return his money back. Eh? Okay. If you don't want to return the money, take your clothes. Take your clothes back. Eh? My brother does not need them. His wife does not need them. I too, I do not need them. To fear kwa ndialo, to fear ndiashawo, umuli kwa neba, ndiori ndialo. What insult? What? Let's let's go. Let's go.
I have called you to this family meeting. And as your husband, to tell you how worried I am about the rumors going on in this village about your activities. Before my brothers here and blessing my brother's wife, and before God, who sees everything hidden, if these rumors and accusations are true. Are what rumors true? That you are killing people with charms. That you paralyzed your husband, our brother, so that you can be lord and master of his life without being challenged by anybody. Those are the rumors. I asked my husband a question, not you. Don't talk to me like that, woman. Don't even think about it. Our brother is us, and we are him. Eunice, answer them. Answer them. Nine. I only answer because I respect you. It is all lies. Whosoever says it's true should come forward with a proof. But the other day you boasted to me about our problems and misfortunes. Yes, I was there. Yes. I was there. So you go ahead and deny this one. We were only quarreling and exchanging words. Doesn't a woman say so many things that are not true during a quarrel? Just to win the quarrel? Uh-uh. Punish you again for writing against me and going to report me to the bishop. Oh, you spirit who serve the god of Ubaka hills and valleys, make Solomon a cripple. Parish. I don't want to be disgraced. I want you to stop him from entering the village. Don't worry. Am I not Igodi? Am I not the controller of the streets of Ebaka Hills and Valleys? I will stop him. Thank you, the
is about to start his battle. But the Lord is my strength. Satan is at it again. I rebuke you, Satan. I rebuke you, Satan. If God be God, and if I serve a living God, and if that same living God that I serve has sent me on this mission, for in the Word, the Bible tells us that Jesus Christ spoke to the troubled waters and he said peace be still and the world tells us that the waters became still i take authority on those words as i said to you in the name of jesus christ the living god i said to you fire i command you be still Battlefield, oh my lord, cause I promise him that I will serve him till I die. I'm on the battlefield for oh my lord. Father, open the bonnet. Father. Forget it. It is not a mechanical problem. Come, get into the car. We'll push the car to safety. I'm on Come the battlefield. Oh, my Lord. Come, push it. I am on the battlefield for oh my Lord. Cause I promise him that I would serve him till I die. I'm on the battlefield push, push, push. for my push. Lord. I am on the battlefield for oh my Lord. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. I'm on the battlefield, oh my lord. Yes, I promise him that I, I'm gonna serve him, I'm gonna serve him, I'm gonna serve him. I'm on the battlefield, Get the bag. oh my lord. The Bible and the cross. We must check down to the village. That convention must take place tomorrow. Come on, let's go. You have the bag. Let's go. The fire has 
said to the water, I am your senior brother. The water said to the fire, it was I who put you up. I am the water. Fight for God! Ah, my father! The Bible says that he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High, I that under the shadow of the Almighty, and he shall say of the Lord, You are my refuge and my strength, and in you and you alone shall I trust in. Father Lord! for today, eh? Bye bye. Bye bye. Who has come? Who has come? The new Reverend Father. So, have you forgotten I'm the queen of seduction? I'll reduce him to nothing just the way I did Father Damien. Hmm, my sister, yes. who must be prepared for war. This war is too strong spiritually. It's even worse. Some of my customers said he'll be holding a crusade in our parish any moment from now. Are you serious? And now? Hmm. Okay. I'll go and welcome him. Yeah, you're right. I think so. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> hey, we'll <see> so, <laughs> later now. Uh -huh. Later. Later. Father. Good evening. You're welcome to our parish. Thank you very much. Um, I presume you must be the president of the Christian Women Organization in the parish. You're correct, Father. I am the one. I say, that's lovely. Well, uh, I'm sorry. As you can see, I just arrived. I have not started receiving visitors yet. Okay. Maybe we have to reschedule for you to come back and see me. No problem, Father. I brought you a little gift of welcome. It's a white material for your castle. It's all right, so thank you should you very find much. time to come and visit you again when you settle down properly. Very well, thank you. Please uh, give it to my father to okay. anywhere else. Come. I'd like to pray over that gift. Spectrum, Ephelio, Espiritus, the Sanctus. God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. I thank you for this gift. Bless the hand of the brother's gift. My brothers and sisters, I had to call this convention. This healing salvation and bondage breaking convention because I sensed in my spirit that evil looms everywhere in this village. I had a bitter experience on my way into the village where the devil Satan manifested himself physically. But as usual,
because the Lord is our strength. God give me victory. Amen. Secondly, I also sense in my spirit that we should do some spiritual cleansing in preparation for the forthcoming crusade. So I'll ask everybody here who is sick, physically or spiritual, in any form of bondage, you're suffering from a broken home, anything that is not of God, to please come forth. Because our Lord Jesus Christ is about to do a great and mighty thing in this village. Amen. So whether the person is here or at home or anywhere, please come forward. it is that is wrong with your son I ask that let your healing spirit come right now and take control and let healing be his in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit Amen. The knee, the right knee is paralyzed. The left or the right? The right. right. Thank you, Jesus. God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Father Lord, whatever is wrong with this leg, I take authority in your word that when Jesus Christ laid his hands on the sick, they became well. Jesus Christ laid his hands on the lame and they walked again. Father Lord, let your spirit manifest itself. Be healed. Amen. Be healed. Amen. Amen. Father, Amen. and of the Son, Amen. and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Oh, 
come and save your people. My spirit is disturbed. I am very disturbed in the spirit. Lord, thank you. Thank you. I hear I'm very disturbed. There is somebody somewhere out there that is challenging the power of the Most High God. Somebody out there! Oh God, my brothers and sisters, come on. We have to pray. We have to pray right now. Come on, pray! Pray! Jesus Christ. Almighty and everlasting Father, God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit, your Son Jesus Christ gave us victory on the cross of Calvary, where he said, it is finished. Lord God, whoever that person is, right now, I ask that your Holy Spirit, let your Holy Spirit, Go forth. Let your Holy Spirit go forth in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Let your Spirit go forth. Let your Holy Spirit go forth right now. And let your children, let victory be that of your children. Amen. Children of God. My brothers and sisters, the battle line has been drawn. And we are going to go out there and fight that battle. Even though we know that Jesus Christ has given us victory. He has fought that battle. It was the same battle he fought on the cross of Calvary and gave us victory. We will go right now and fight that battle. Some people here that I will choose will come with me while others will Stay behind and pray while we're gone. Because God is going to do great and mighty thing right here while we're gone. Now, you call me. You, 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 come with me. We cannot do, we cannot do.
daughter of Jezebel. Oh, Lord our God! How long will you allow this seat of wickedness abide? Destroy, destroy! Oh, you seven spirits of Ibaka, heels! Time of decision has come. Arise and destroy your enemy! You trust in your charms. You trust in your amulets. You trust in those spirits of yours. But I trust in one true living God whose armor I put on. I come against you in that name. May fire devour you. You who dare rise up against darkness. May darkness suck you away. Today, mark the end of you. Yes, my daughter. Receive the power. 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 Our God is a God to make fire. Our God is also a God of war. Come, brothers and sisters. Come, for God has given us victory. Come and pray over her. Pray. Pray! 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 In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And amen. And amen. Jesus, <laughs>
my daughter. Rise again! And have no fear. No God is God except Igodi of Ibaka Hills and Valleys. No power can be compared to mine, be it in heavens or on the earth. I am El Dorado, the Endless One. <laughs> My God! My God! Why have thou forsaken me? I shall not die, but live to fulfill the works of the Lord in the land of the living. Jesus, Jesus, the Son of God, have mercy on me. Jesus Christ. 
surprise you because you are Lord. You are Lord. I come against you. I come against you in Jesus' mighty name. I come against you. accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior? Yes, Jesus is Lord. I accept him as my Lord and Savior. Go, for the Lord has forgiven you. Come on, rise, get up. Up, up. Go. Thank you, Jesus. Go in peace. Let us all write it in our hearts today that the Lord has come to dwell with us. Amen. It is well with the children of God. Amen. Say after me, it is well with the children of God. It is well with the children of God.
जरूर 